Hello friends, in this video we are going to discuss the dimensions of permeability of free space. For that, let us consider a current carrying conductor of length L. Just here I am considering very small this length dl of this current carrying conductor. Now what is the magnetic field due to this small current carrying conductor at a point P which was located from this conductor at a distance R that will be dB. That is the magnetic field due to only this small current carrying conductor. Now write the formula for magnetic field due to this small current carrying conductor at a point P which was located at a distance R from this. That is given by dB is equal to formula mu naught by 4 pi into I dl sin theta by R square. Here I is the current through this conductor. dl is the smallest length we have considered. R is the distance between this current carrying conductor and the point we have considered. Here mu naught is the permeability of free space. For that we have to find the dimensions. Now bring mu naught to this side the remaining terms db r square into 4 pi upon i dl sin theta. Now write the formula for this magnetic field which is equal to f upon qv sin theta. This is the formula for magnetic field into r square into here it is already 4 pi upon i dl sin theta. Now do the simplification f into r square into 4 pi upon this will comes to the denominator. So q v i dl and sin, sin theta into sin theta sin squared theta. Now find separately the dimensions of force. Here q is a charge, v is the velocity. Then we will substitute here it is in this formula. For force, force is equal to formula mass into acceleration. Write the SI unit for mass and acceleration kg into meter per second square. Now write the dimensions for kg is expressed in terms of capital M, length is expressed in terms of capital L, second is expressed in terms of capital T. Here power minus 2 is there so T power minus 2 which is equal to M L T power minus 2. This is the dimensional formula for force. Now let us see for charge. Charge is equal to formula current multiplied by time. Now write the SI unit for a current ampere. And for time second. Now write the dimensions. Ampere is expressed in terms of capital A. And second is expressed in terms of capital T. A T. This is the dimensional formula for charge. Now write the dimensions for velocity. Velocity is equal to formula displacement per unit time. V is equal to SI unit of displacement is meter and for time is second which is equal to M into S to the power of minus 1. Now write the dimensions. Meter is expressed in terms of capital L and second is expressed in terms of capital T. Here power minus 1 is there so T power minus 1. This is the dimensional formula for velocity. Now let us substitute these three values here in this equation. We will get mu naught is equal to here for force we got m l t power minus 2 into here it is r square r is the distance between this current carrying conductor and the, the point so distance is expressed in terms of meters and meter is expressed in terms of capital l so r square is the l square and 4 pi is a constant constant does not have any 
dimensions and q is a charge here we got a t okay into here it is a velocity t power minus 1 and uh, here i is the current dimensions of current is ampere and uh, dl is there that is length so it is sin square theta is a trigonometric function and the trigonometric ratios does not have any dimensions that means sin square theta is a dimensionless quantity here 4 pi and sin square theta are the dimensionless quantities now do the simplification here here it is l into l that means l square so here l square will be get cancelled t power minus 1 and t power 1 will get cancelled the remaining terms are here m l t power minus 2 upon here only ampere and ampere so a square which is equal to m l t power minus 2 and write this a square on the numerator so it becomes as a power minus 2 this is the dimensional formula for permeability of free space i hope you understand if you like the video please do like share and subscribe